I think this moment means more to me than anything else I've done in wrestling. I've made history in Japan by being the youngest to main event Corrigan Hall, but this hits different. This really does. Today I main event my first ever ROH pay-per-view and my first ever pay-per-view ever. <laughs> this is definitely a crazy moment for me. Uh, watching Final Battle as a little kid and now being able to say I'm at Final Battle and performing in front of my fans and friends and family. I know my dad wants me to win more than anything today, but my mom just wants me to have fun and just enjoy the show. <laughs> I'm getting to fight someone who I called my friend or mentor. And you can say I turned my back, but I'm not the villain of this story. I want to put on a good show. I don't want to be the stooge that everybody thinks I am here. I'm no minion. I'm Billy Starks. I'm relaxed, but it's more of my way of having the calm before the storm. Uh, I need to have a sense of like calmness for myself, but I definitely feel it. I felt it the last like two or three days, and this is my first day that I haven't been freaking out, but I think it's because I'm around everybody and I have to keep a game face on. Like a lot of people are rooting for you. Yeah, I, it was crazy waking up this morning and seeing all the support I had even from people I've never met before. Um, but I, I just truly want to make everybody proud. I don't want to disappoint anybody tonight. And I, I think no matter what, I'm going to make everyone proud. I don't know, I just want to have fun today and I hope everybody enjoys it. <laughs> um, I'm trying to show everybody that I'm the wrestler that I can be. That's what I want to do today. I don't want to be a stooge or a minion anymore. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Can I tell you what I was doing when I was 19? What were you doing? I was sitting in my parents' house, <laughs> killing time waiting to go back to college. Mm -hmm. I, to do what you're doing at this level is absolutely unreal right I finished now. my first semester of college while I've been awesome. here, so I think, I think the most awesome. important thing is, is not only what you're doing at this age pro wrestling wise, but at this age period. Like you, you have made college your main thing. And I, the only thing I have for you is like finish school. Period. Yeah. Because here's the deal. You're going to be great at whatever you do. You're going to be great at whatever you do. But if you finish school and be great at whatever you do, it's less likely you can get nose at whatever you want to do. I just want a little farm after pro wrestling yeah. so I can run my own little farm and training school. Have the BSB Performance Center and then, uh, make my trainees go take care of my cows for me. That's my dream. That sounds like a Briscoe plan. That sounds like a hey, yep. <laughs> hey, guys. Big night for Big, Big Bill. Bill. <laughs> I love you, Lexi. I'm gonna be honest, as a woman's wrestler, having to put on makeup is the worst part about being a woman's wrestler. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Are you gonna do the show tomorrow, AEW? Yes, of course. Maybe I'll have a belt around my waist Ooh. when I show up. I would so. hope so, or else you'd have to wear suspenders. It would be uncomfortable. <laughs> be a little awkward, right? Yeah. So, thank you. Thank you, RJ. Uh, enjoy yourself. I will. Okay. <laughs> I'm excited. I, I truly just feel like it's gonna be fun. Yeah. And I feel like I've been waiting to be put in a position like this, so it's exciting to finally be trusted to be here. It's that time. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna go crazy. <laughs> I'm freezing in this venue. Well, my gear today was designed by Allie Parker. Shout out Allie Parker. Um, this vest was actually made by my mom. She did a phenomenal job. We added like a bunch of pins, a bunch of cool stuff on here. And then I have one of my t-shirt designs on the back. Ugh. I'm not gonna lie, I put a makeup on and now I'm stressed. I'm starting to tear up. <laughs> Ooh but it's gonna be fire, I can't wait. It's gonna be a big night. There's definitely a lot of pressure on me to perform and be the best that I can be. 
And there's a lot of eyes on me saying, do I deserve this? And I'm about to show everybody that I do. Like, I've been doing this for the past five years. I gave up my childhood for this. This is what I deserve because I'm going to be main inventing every single night. My stepfather, Mouse, was the guy who got me into wrestling and why I love it so much to this day. He took me to a bunch of ROH shows when I was growing up, and it was like the first thing that I remember being so connected to as a fan of like finding wrestlers that I loved and watching shows that were just amazing shows. No matter what, the performers were putting on a great show, no matter what day of the week it was. And as a little kid, it was just inspiring to see. You're gonna kill it, all right? All right, I love you. I love you. Please be careful, all right? It's very surreal right now. This is my life. I get to put on a show for the world to enjoy. Billy Sparks, highly intelligent graduate, college standout student. She does so much, so she is a great learner. I don't think Athena had to teach Billy Sparks everything, just enough to find out the kinks and the armor of the champion. The Prodigy, 19 years old! Oh, oh. Starks, Starks! Oh! This has got to be the greatest match Billy Starks has ever wrestled, and definitely the biggest challenge from Athena. Will the challenger tap? Will the champion retain? The crowd does not want Billy Starks to give up. Is she saying yes? Oh, She's yes, giving up. Hey. time under my belt than anybody else right now. I'm gonna make it worth it. Thanks, Giovanni. You were tremendous, Thank you. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> Thanks for washing my gear when I get home. I appreciate you. <laughs> I love you too. I will tell Sky you said hello. <laughs> Bye, Mom, I love you. My ma, Jay, <laughs> uh, she told me she was very proud of me. Um, she was mad about the blood. Um, <laughs> she's washing my gear when I get home, if you didn't hear. <laughs> um, but apparently there were watch parties for me from Tennessee, Louisville, Florida, all over the states just to see my crap tonight. And uh, the support I got on the internet from like people I got to watch growing up wrestling was really crazy and very emotional for me today. Um, <laughs> I miss you, dude. Thank you. Give me love, y'all. Give me love. I need you. I'm just happy. I'm just truly, truly happy. I feel like everybody's little sister in wrestling and it truly makes you feel loved. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>